I've seen a lot of progressive women, generally speaking, they're quick to defend women's rights and speak out against using rape as a, as a weapon of war. But downright silent on what we saw on October 7th and what might be happening inside Gaza right now to these hostages. Why is that? I, I, I mean, I don't, I don't know that that's true. I think we, we always talk about the impact of war on women in particular. I've condemned what Hamas has done. I've condemned Specifically all of women. the actions. Absolutely. The, the rape, the, of course. But I think we have to remember that Israel is a democracy. That is why they are a strong ally of ours. And if they do not comply with international humanitarian law, they are bringing themselves to a place that makes it much more difficult strategically for them yeah. to be able to build the kinds of allies to keep public opinion yeah. with them. And frankly, uh, morally, I think we cannot say that one war crime deserves another. That is not what international humanitarian with, with, law says. Okay, with, with respect, I was just asking about the the women and you turned it back to Israel. I'm asking you about Hamas, in fact. I already answered your question, Dana. I, I said it's horrific and okay. I think that rape is horrific, sexual assault is horrific. I think that it happens in war situations. Terrorist organizations like Hamas obviously are using these as tools. Mm -hmm. However, I think we have to be balanced about bringing in the outrages against Palestinians. Yeah. 15,000 Palestinians have been killed in Israeli airstrikes, three quarters of whom and it's, are women and children. And it's horrible, but you're, you don't see Israeli soldiers raping um, Well, Dana, I think women. we're not, we're not, I, I don't want this to be the hierarchy of oppressions. I don't, but. I just can't. I, but we have to remember, she's asked about rape and then she goes, but we have to remember. She's asked about Jews being savage, Jewish women being savage, and she goes, it happens. It happens in wartime. She's asked again about it. And she goes, yes, it's terrible. It's bad. I'm against it. However, acting as if nobody's talked about the civilian death toll in Gaza. She can't just condemn Jewish women being brutalized and it being videotaped and people seeing it. She just can't. She can't. It's always a but. We have to remember it happens in war. However, no. we have to remember. Yeah. So